Welcome back to Sea Stories with Mr. Do Right. I am your host, Mr. Do Right, and today's show, Redemption. Hopefully, I can redeem myself and not be jacked up no more. Man, a lot of stuff has happened, and we had to change some things. And I'm gonna tell you all about it right after this. Randall. This is Sea Stories with your host, Mr. Do Right, and the lovely So Long. If you're a vet about to be a vet, or thinking of becoming a vet, this is the show for you. So be on hot standby for laughs, tears, and the nuttiest duo since Laverne and Shirley. Laverne and Shirley. Guys, you're telling your age right now. Mr. Do Right, so long. Let's start the show. And we're back. Man, have I missed you guys. Man, I love y'all to death, and if y'all watching this, Thank you very much. Now, I promised you an explanation of what the hell is going on, and now I'm about to give it to you. So check this out, people. I put out a video, a video, blah, 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 blah. I put out a video called Movie PO Top 10 Movies of 2015, right? And it was my top 10 movies. Love movies. I had to make a video. Now, I made the video, uploaded to YouTube, I hit publish. And then, pow! The movie got deleted. The video got deleted. I ain't make no movie yet. And YouTube said, I have violated the community guidelines. Somebody's grandma was pissed off. I don't know what happened. And I got a big strike. Now, I am in bad standings with YouTube. Which means they took away my live privileges. So I can't stream live no more. Which sucks. And I can't make any videos over 15 minutes. Which also sucks because I can talk. Now, I am on probation for six months. Man, I feel like I, I, I ran a red light or something. Or I can appeal it. So I've appealed it. You know, hey, y'all y'all all jacked up. It ain't me. It's all y'all. Please give me my privileges back because I got a show to put on. My people depend on me putting on this live show. But you know how it is. You can't deal with governments and you can't deal with corporations. I'm just a little guy, so here I am. So we're not going to let that stop us. We're not going to let that get us down. I'm not stopping. Y'all not stopping. We ain't stopping nothing. So we're going to still shoot this live in front of a live Randall audience. Then we're going to take it and break it down into videos so you can consume it as you see fit. That's how we're going to do it. And I believe that's the best way to do it because we're not going to let them get us down. We're not going to do it. So that's what we're doing. And, you know, I, I, I'm disappointed that this happened. I didn't know it was going to happen. Like at the beginning of every year, somebody goes into YouTube and crank up all the dials and everything saying, oh, why is this all like this? It's all jacked up. This is not by procedure. And then the, the, the robots that be checking videos and stuff start going slap crazy. Man. And, and the truth about it, they don't even tell you what you did wrong. It, imagine this. You're driving down the street. The light's behind you. Woo, and pull you over. And then the cop just walk up and just give you a ticket. Here you go. Have a nice day. You're like, what did I get a ticket for? Don't worry about it. See you later. And you know, it's like, who does that? But YouTube does that. They won't tell you what the hell you did. You know, and then anybody can sit there and hit you on something just because. And you're guilty until you're proven innocent. Because nobody going to believe you. They can just put a strike on you. And then you got to prove that you don't, you didn't do nothing wrong. Even though you don't know what the hell you did. So, there it is. And that's why I can't stream to you live. And I know I keep coming to y'all with my problems. It's like, oh, I'm sorry. I'm jacked up. We didn't record. Oh, I'm jacked up because this and that. I know. But shit happens. You know shit happens. But I'm not stopping. We not stopping. So, Wong ain't stopping. So, hey, here it is. So, deal with it. Uh, what else I want to talk to you about? Uh, how much time we got left? Oh, we got plenty of time. I ain't even started running my mouth yet. But that's what I just want to let y'all know some stuff about that. Oh, also, because I know you're probably saying, uh, look at that big ass elephant in the room. You see, we got my tactical gear on today, right? Yes. I told you I was going to do better on costumes and try to bring y'all more, more content and stuff like that. Here I am. We're doing it up right. 
I got my tactical glasses on. I got my tactical helmet on. I got my tactical vest with like 15,000 pockets in it. And I got to go buy a whole bunch of stuff to put in all the pockets. But I am ready to go. I got some stuff and it's going to be awesome. Super awesome. So stand by for that. I'm trying to make up some new characters. Maybe bring back some old characters. I wonder what old um, Chief Squadaway is doing right about now. But don't don't say his name because I don't need him to come out here right now. Ooh, I'm already jacked up enough. Let us get situated first before we bring him into the mix. Anyway, we're going to keep bringing you this show. I missed y'all. Hope you missed us. We love doing this and we're going to keep on doing it even if nobody's watching it because we love doing it. And with that, let's go to a message real quick and then I'll be closing this out. Randall, hook us up. To another edition of Pathways, your leadership connection. Giving you the tools you need to take your leadership to a whole nother level. Well, my name is Richard Helm. I'm your certified speaker, coach, and trainer, and member of the John Maxwell team. Each time I come before you, I have three simple goals. I want to encourage you, I want to empower you, and I always hope to enlighten you. Today, we're gonna to talk about another one of my favorite topics. How to be successful in your organization. The five levels of leadership from Mr. John Maxwell. Power of serving. The leadership role of the man in the marriage. Whether you're married or whether you're single, this might be worth listening to. Thank y'all for checking me out on Sea Stars with Mr. Do Right with your host, Mr. Do Right. So Wong will be here. She will be here tomorrow, February 11. If you're watching this at the 11, then you probably missed it. But check us out anyway. Uh, what else can I say? She missed y'all. She wants to be here so bad. And it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. I miss her too. I miss playing around with her. And not like that. Get your minds right. But anyway, thanks for checking us out. See stories with Mr. Do-Right with your host, Mr. Do-Right. And until next time, peace.